Hello there. General Kenobi. All right, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? Good God. I hope you're all having a great, fantastic day. And obviously, this is the Q&A video. The 300 subscriber Q&A video. Good God. We're almost at 350, and now I'm uploading the 300 Q&A video. You know what I mean? We're moving fast. We're growing fast. And I just want to say, you're sexy. You're awesome. You're beautiful. And stay you. That shirt that you're wearing right now? It's looking good. It's looking good. Only on you. Only on you. Anyways, um, let's actually get into the substance of the video. I'm trying to be a little bit more energetic. Or I don't know. So basically, here's what we're going to do. The first half of the video is actually going to be on the lucky draw that I decided to do for the Honey Badger HBR Legendary Thingamajigger. So I decided to pick this one up. And I think it's a very cool gun. Still, you know what I mean? My opinion from last time is still the same. It's a very cool gun. So what we're first going to do is go over that lucky draw. You know what I mean? See if we had any luck. We didn't. And then we're actually going to be answering the questions. So let's actually get straight into the lucky draw first. Ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so let's actually get into the first part of the video, which we're first, as I said, going to do the Honey Badger, Honey Badger Lucky Draw. So we have a good amount of cop points over here. Let's see if we can get the HBR A3. Okay, this is a really, really cool gun. Really cool. I know that when me and my girlfriend play tonight, because we usually play, she's purposely going to run around just to pick up the gun after I die. So I'll make sure to die a couple of times. <laughs> Anyways. The character skin I really do not care about. I think he sucks. I said what I said. I think he sucks. Okay, so let's actually get into this. So, first pull. Good God. What do we get? We get the spray. Yes, a W. No, I'm kidding. That's not W. That's not W. I don't know how loud it got, how loud it got in the microphone, but that's not W. Let's continue on. I'm really excited for you guys' questions, by the way. So, this is a cool pistol. I'll give it that. I'll give it that. I'll give it that, but that's really it. Can we please get, like, the gun? Can I Can I, can I get lucky and get the gun? If I, imagine, imagine if I got lucky. Oh, my gosh. I feel like I'm going to have to go all the way. Like, I don't want to go all the way because life. You know what I mean? But, come on, give me that. Okay, fine, whatever. What's going to happen here? Can we just get the gun? Just give me the gun. Give me the gun. <laughs> I don't want to get the character. The character so... Eh. Please, the gun. The gun. Okay. Okay. I mean, like, we knew it. We knew we were going to get this guy. Come on. It's it's a it's a lucky draw. We all knew. And, oh, my God. I wonder what we're going to get. Guys, what are we going to get? Uh -huh. uh, uh, did, did he even hit? Okay. Yeah, there it is. There it is. I'm going to admit, it looks, it's gorgeous. It's such a beautiful weapon. Oh my gosh. Good God. This is really, this is a really cool gun. And it's on the HBR. The HBR is one of the best weapons out there. So, okay, let's actually get into the Q&A video. So, question number one. What made you want to be a COD Mobile YouTuber? Well, um, I first started off as a Mortal Kombat Mobile YouTuber. Because I, because the fun, the game was really fun, but over time it just grew boring on me. And then I wanted to play COD Mobile and the game grew on me then. And I just wanted to upload videos for fun. Nothing more, nothing less, just for fun. Here and there, randomly. But now we're obviously doing bigger things. Slowly, not bigger things, but we're, you know, uploading more consistently. What will you do if you have 1k subs on your channel? That's a secret. I have it totally planned, 110%. I have everything planned and I'm very excited for it. Will you ever change your intro? What? Do you have an Instagram dedicated to your gaming channel? No, I do not, but maybe later on in the future. Why don't you play Mortal Kombat no more? Hmm, um, good question. The reason I don't is because the game just got a little bit boring on me. I don't... Whenever I try to log in and play the game, I don't know, it just seems repetitive at this point. Like, yes, new skins, new characters, but I don't know, it just, 
it's getting, I don't know, I played the game for years, and it became literally boring at that point. Like, I knew everything that was going to happen, not happen, I don't know. It was getting boring. Do you prefer multiplayer games or to go solo? I prefer multiplayer. It's just my style, my taste. Like the video checkpoint. Thank you, my bro. Thank you. What is the first video game you've ever played? Very good question. I think it was... I think it was possibly, quite possibly, 2009 Need for Speed Pro Street, I think. I think it was that game. How long have you been playing COD Mobile for? Ever since the middle of Season 3. So it's been a, quite, a, quite a long time. And by the way, by Season 3, I mean the, um, the Battle Pass Season 3, not Ranked. Even though Ranked was the same thing, Season 3. What are a few of your favorite gaming channels? Oh, this is a very good question. I like this question. So, for COD Mobile, I'm a big fan of Hawk's Nest. He, he, he's into gun analytics, and he really did inspire me. Him and Drifter, so Hawk's Nest. And when it comes down to, in general, gaming channels, I love Feudives. That man is literally a beast, okay? On PC, when he's playing Mod Warfare, let me tell you something. If you see his username, just back out. Just leave the lobby. Just look, save your KD. Just leave the lobby. Leave it. You're saving yourself. My man dropped a nuke in skill-based matchmaking, modern warfare, SND. Search and destroy. Man, it's crazy. Um, I also really do watch... What's his face? Exo Ghost. Exo Ghost is literally crazy. He is also a PC player. He's crazy. He knows what he's doing and my biggest flex is the fact that he watched one of my videos and he commented on it he watched one of them he commented on it and he and he agreed with me i remember i did not even expect him to see my video at all i was like exo goes watching my video what no that's a lie but yeah he did i'm posting stuff on the screen right now for you guys but he did and i was like so surprised i was like what you're actually watching my video this is crazy you're agreeing with my comment, which is crazy. I don't know. I feel like he does it quite a while to his subscribers or to people randomly. I don't know. Um, another YouTuber that I'm a big fan of is Sergeant Gaz. He's the number one player on in Black Ops 4 on PS4. So on the PS4 servers and on the PS4 database, he's the number one player. And yes, it does fluctuate every now and then, but in general, he's the number one player because, you know, we have to take into consideration the hackers as well as a number of other things, but he's the number one player on Black Ops 4. And holy cow, that man is crazy. He is crazy. He knows what he's doing. I hope your mom fucks up your favorite meal. I hope the little plastic ends on your shoelaces come off. I hope the next time that you're using ketchup, it squirts out all the water and oils and shit first before the ketchup. I hope your left trigger gets stuck on your controller. The experience of having somebody spawn inside of my rectum. How am I supposed to deal with it? I can't deal. I just went through and explained everything. I'm back. Um, I'm gonna link everybody's channel down below as well if you want to check them out. I highly recommend subscribing to them, as well as Sergeant Gaz, especially Sergeant Gaz. He's so underrated. My man only has 30k subs. This man is a monster. Let me tell you. Anyways, moving on. Is Ariana Bay your girlfriend? Yes, it is. Yes, she is. Yeah. Why'd I say it? <laughs> yes, she is. She's, she's my girlfriend. Um, she's very she's very awesome and very supportive. How old are you? I'm 20 years old. That's why um, sometimes I post daily, sometimes I don't. It's be I try to post consistently, but because of college and because of, you know, work and, you know, life, I can't. There's always something coming up. I'm never free. I'm, I'm always doing something. You know college homework work videos or sleeping sometimes sometimes your man gotta sleep when did you first start playing call of duty 2013 when i was 13 that was the first time i started playing call of duty cod 4 what's the best part of cod mobile and what's your favorite melee my the best part of cod mobile i think is the fact that this game is a combination of all the other call of duty games and you know it's just put into one mobile platform. And I'm a big fan of that. You know what I mean? Like you can play 1944 shipment on using the KN44 
and then go on Nuketown from BO1 and be using a gun like the Cordite. Like, it's combining all these different Call of Duty games into one. And it's, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. What's your favorite melee? My favorite melee is the Hachi. It's the sword. Um, it's the sword. I accidentally got it in a crate. I remember I did not want to open this one crate, but I accidentally clicked open or whatever. I don't know. I accidentally opened up 10. And the first one I got was the Hachi. I was like, okay. Okay, okay, I give myself that. Okay. What gun do you want added in Call of Duty Mobile? This is a very good question. A, a weapon that I want added is my favorite gun in all of Call of Duty. It's the FAMAS, the FAMAS from Black Ops 1. I love that gun. Dude, let me tell you something. I abused that weapon so much. <laughs> I remember I would put suppressor on that thing and I don't know. It was my favorite thing to do. I didn't even use multiple attachments. I only used the... the... Shoot. I don't know if you can hear me snapping, but shoot, I'm trying to remember. What is it? I don't know. Just the silencer. I just used the silencer on the FAMAS. It was beautiful. Please, Call of Duty Mobile, if you're watching this video for some unknown reason, which I know you're not, um, please add the FAMAS from Black Ops 1. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. I love that gun. Um, let's move on. How many fingers do you play with? Two. I play with two fingers. I'm a two finger thumb. The thumb gangs. Double thumbs. I'm one of those people. Do you have a Discord server? If not, you should make one. You're right, I should. I may make one fairly soon in the future. I've, I have plans of that. But you're absolutely correct. It's really, it's a good idea to make one. I think I'm gonna need admin though, administers in the server, but I will go over that. I'll be making a video separately on that later on in the future, soon, soon, don't worry. Thank you, that's a very good recommendation. What motivated you to start doing YouTube? Honestly, nothing really. I just decided to do it for fun. Nothing much, honestly. I remember my very first video was a Terminator unboxing video for Mortal Kombat Mobile or something. Like, card pack opening for Terminator. I just was saving up so many souls and I randomly uploaded a video. I don't know. I, I don't know what motivated me. I just do it for fun. Let's continue. What is your sensitivity? I'm gonna be posting a you know little video screenshot up here for for everyone to see. Why aren't you playing Mortal Kombat anymore? Um, I don't know. Did I already answer this question? I think I did, but it's just repeated. Basically, it got boring. It got stale. That's why I'm not really into it anymore. If you guys want me to get back into it, then I'll play. Um, maybe every now and then, every Friday, I'll play it. What or who got you into video games in the first place? Nobody. Nobody really got me into it. I think I just... I think I just went in... I, I think I just got myself into it, honestly. So let's actually move on. So over here, we have another question, which says, when will you start be... When will you start playing with viewers? Um, hmm. In the future, I will. I just... I'm just one of those type of people who likes to play alone like i'm a solo player i don't know i just always like to go solo i'm weird i don't know but in the future i will trust me i will it's a it's a plan that i do have and i will be doing so but for now just for now not yet but i will be trust me it's a it's a it's a plan in the making good question thank you bro now let's actually move on to our next and i think this is the final question no no this is the second to final are you in Garena or Global and where are you from? Okay. Sad I didn't reach the question link. I believe the link should work, but now now it should work. But anyways, I'm, I'm going to shut it off after this video goes live. <clears throat> so I'm in Global and I'm on the West Coast. So that's that. West Coast of US of A. So let's actually move on. This is the final. No. This is the second and final question. What do you think about the only bundle community? I'm just curious. Very good question. I just made a video. Well, I know I didn't make it yet. I just have it written down. But I'm going to be releasing a video right after this talking about the whole bundle crate situation in the community. Don't worry. That, that is an issue. And that's a very good thing that you raised it. So I want to thank you for that. That's going to be coming up in a video. So your question has a whole video dedicated to it. Um, final question. What's your favorite gun? And if you have a legendary or epic skin for it, what is your favorite one? My favorite gun is... Hmm. 
Okay, this is a good question. This has me thinking. It would either be the Cordite. It would either be the Cordite Zero G. Like my favorite gun is the Cordite. And my favorite legendary or epic skin would be the, the Zero G version, which is from Black Ops 4. The reason I love it, yeah, it's that one. I'm gonna have to go with this one because I love Black Ops 4 and I always use the Cordite. Yeah, I was a Cordite user for those who played Black Ops 4. And this Zero G skin was known as a Mastercraft in there. There were Mastercraft weapons. And when I saw this, in COD Mobile, I said, I need to get it. I love the gun. I don't know. I, I really did enjoy Black Ops 4. I thought Black Ops 4 was a pretty solid game. When it came down to multiplayer, if you removed the specialist weapons and abilities, it was a pretty good multiplayer experience. It was a fun game. But obviously, it was not flawless. It was not a flawless game. When in, Now, when it comes down to... The whole favorite gun, though, in general, yeah, it's the Cordite as well. Favorite gun in general is the Cordite, and favorite skin for it in general is the Cordite Zero G. Um, those are all the questions I have. I will be getting to the next question, which is, you know, the, the whole bundle situation soon after this. I'm just going to eat, breathe, sleep, and then create it and upload it hopefully so today may be a double upload but yeah that's really it for today's video um if you guys enjoyed it please make sure to leave a like please make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel and i do want to say this comment down below if i answered your question correctly like maybe i missed a part of it or something i don't know anyways have a great fantastic day ladies and gentlemen stay positive stay beautiful stay you